the KHQA Student Athlete of the Week, sponsored by Blessing Health System. Grand Slam for Macy Fisher for Canton. Really just I feel like my dad has instilled that in me from a very young age, you know, I played competitive sports since I was like nine, so um, him just pushing me every single day uh, in practices, you know, after games we always have talks about, you know, pushing yourself, being a leader, so he's really been huge uh, for that for me, and then all the travel coaches that I have had, all the high school coaches that I've had have really just instilled that in me, and I couldn't be more grateful. Ask any of the coaches or teachers who have spent time in Macy Fisher's orbit and they too will attest that the experience has been beneficial for them as well. One laced by the unique satisfaction of getting to work with someone so expressly devoted to their own betterment in all things. It's a personal success that wells for Macy from an intense competition within her. One generally directed, however, inward rather than out. You know, my other classmates are always pushing me to be better. Uh, I think I'm third in our class right now. So yeah, just always trying to push myself to be better in the classroom, just like I do on the court or on the field is, is important. Usually I'm pretty organized uh, for the most part. I try to, I feel like that's important to, you know, be organized. It just helps me uh, uh, be like efficient. And, you know, since I'm always so busy, I'm you know, doing sports year round. And I'm just I'm really, I feel like school is really important. It's probably more important than athletics, honestly. but. So just staying organized is really important to me and uh, keeping my grades up. Whatever the trigger, you certainly can't argue the efficacy or efficiency of her approach. A flawless GPA that hasn't gotten the way of all district level stardom on the pitch, on the hardwood, and on the diamond, where she's now also a two-time All-State selection. And as of last Tuesday, the newest future top of the lineup catalyst for Kirkwood softball. I put in a lot of hours just like, um, you know, perfecting my game and just, um, you know, trying to get better for my, for my team, for my school. You know, travel ball has been huge for me. So just to finally sign and just be um, at a school that I know I'm going to love and have success at is just huge. Kirkwood was awesome. Um, whenever I went there after the visit, I just, I knew that that was going to be the school for me. I know that they're a super competitive program, really good. They've been good for the past several years. So, um, and I really think that Coach Freeze and Coach Adams can really help me develop my game. So I'm really looking forward to just getting better. He really likes my speed, and uh, I think that um, just um, being, you know, fast it has, has been one of the, the more important parts of my game. Uh, so I think that, that I'll, I'll look to translate that into the college level. But Macy's future legacy doesn't end at the dugout. With the cultivation of the natural helper tendency within her, perfectly channeled to a vocation where she can do some real meaningful good in this world. Um, I love those kids. Um, just every day, whenever I get to see them, it just puts a smile on my face. And I feel like that, at that uh, stage, it's just like important for their development and you know everything they're doing. They're learning their letters, how to write their names. You know, they're learning just like fine motor skills and uh, how to communicate with each other. And I think that that's just really interesting. And it's something that I really want to uh, just put a lot of work into. And I think that it's really rewarding. Judging by her fan club at signing day, Macy Fisher has already demonstrated an aptitude for that next evolution as well. Just one more page in a legacy that includes her status as a beloved teammate, universally respected by both her peers and her instructors, and not insignificantly historically here, her rare status as a state champion Lady Tiger as well. In the words, um, just what this school and just all the sports that I played have, have meant to me, um, you know, winning state was, it's got to be one of the best moments of my high school career here and I, I wouldn't trade any of those memories or any, any of the experience that I gained for granted, you know, I take it, just it was insane and I'm, I'm just really happy that I got to experience it.